Hey everyone, as always, Dylan Miller Prospecting, and it is pay dirt review time again. And today I'm going to be comparing two bags of pay dirt from loadedpaydirt.com. Now, this company is out of Virginia, and I've heard through the grapevine that they are in somehow either related or started by somebody from Golden Pater. But the one thing that this company has that Golden Pater does not have is a guaranteed bag. This bag right here is guaranteed one gram of gold. It is their Nugget Edition bag, and I decided to compare it to one of their Nugget bags that isn't guaranteed. So I'll be curious to see. I know I will be getting one gram out of the guaranteed bag, but I'm really curious to find out what I will get and what my ROI will be on the non-guaranteed bag. These bags are identical in every way, supposedly, except for that one has a guaranteed one gram of gold in it. So let me flash up the description on these bags of pay dirt, and then we're going to go to the overhead, classify this down, pan it out, and find out what kind of gold we get. As you saw, a very lengthy description. I only put up one description because they both have the exact same description. The only difference is on the one gram guaranteed bag, it is in the title that is guaranteed one gram. Other than that, the descriptions are the exact same. Saying that the pay dirt is from Virginia, the gold comes from pretty much anywhere, and that you could find any size gold. It does say curiously though that most of the gold will be in the form of at least one nice gold nugget and or picker. And I'm going to be really curious to see how that works out because you never know what someone considers a picker or a nugget. It doesn't state any weight on the bags but we're going to weigh it up just out of curiosity. So the regular nugget edition, one pound, 1.8 ounces. The one gram bag, 15 ounces. So I'm guessing somewhere around a pound is what these bags are going to be. Let's open them up and see what this pay dirt looks like. Now, normally I would be classifying this material down, but it is damp, so we're going to have to speed up a little bit of time, and we're going to be right back with some dry pay dirt. One hour later, pay dirt is dry. So it's nice and dry. I'm going to check it for magnetics a little bit better. Everything won't be sticking together. So pretty good amount. I mean, not a ton. I'm not going to reweigh the pay dirt, even though now it is dry because there's no stated weight in the description. So, a little bit. So, let's just listen to some music and classify these down. So there we go, all classified down. And as you can see, both bags look pretty similar in the amount of pay dirt in them. Obviously there is more in the lower classification than in the upper classification with probably the most of it being in the minus 40. So I'll be really curious to find out where the gold is. This top one, this one here, is guaranteed one gram of gold. The other nugget bag has no guarantee other than it being rich pay dirt. So we're going to find out. I'm going to go pan it out, and we're going to find out where this gold is and where these nuggets are. So I have my water, have my pan, have all the different pay dirt here, and we're going to get started with the plus 10. We're going to do the nugget bag with no guaranteed gold, and then we'll do the plus 10 for the nugget edition with one gram of gold in it. So let's just get started.
Well, finished panning everything out as you saw, and it was some pretty cloudy material, and it did have some organics, but we're going to talk about that in a minute. For now, let's just get to the gold I found. In the plus 10, I did find some, but only in one bag. In the no guarantee bag, I found nothing. In the guaranteed bag, I found four little pieces that I would not consider to be a nugget. <laughs> not even close. Maybe a picker, but definitely not a nugget. Those are not nuggets. Now in the minus 10, plus 20, even more gold. A nice little pile in both ones. About five or six little pieces in this one. Again, no nuggets. And probably close to 20 pieces in here for the guaranteed bag. Now in the minus 20, plus 40, eh, eh, nothing. Not even one piece in either bag. So that was pretty disappointing. And finally, in the minus 40, eh, eh, again, no gold, not even one piece, either bag. So let's just weigh these up to see what kind of gold I did get. Now, in the no guarantee bag, I only found gold in one classification. And there you go, 0 0.195 in the no guarantee bag. Now, in the guaranteed one gram bag, which I am guaranteed one gram, in the plus 10, 0 0.160. And in the minus 10 plus 20, 0 0.815, 820. So let's see, I'm pretty sure I'm short here though. 0 0.985, so not even a gram. <sighs> so now let's just talk about pay dirt difficulty. Easy, easy to go through for a beginner, advanced, or an expert panner. While it was a little bit cloudy and it did have a little bit of black sands, the gold was just, there was just no small gold. There was nothing in the minus 20 down. So it's pretty easy to find this gold. So difficulty, easy, all the way around. All right, finished calculating my ROI, writing up my review, and let's get right to it. This again was from LoadedPayDirt.com. This was their Nugget Edition bag, and this is their Nugget Edition bag with one gram of gold guaranteed. Now let's just start with the Nugget Edition with nothing guaranteed. Had no guaranteed amount of gold, as I said. Its cost was $40. Shipping was free. So total cost right here, 40 bucks. Gold recovered again right here. 0 0.195 grams. Now gold spot on the day this was received was $57.96, making this gold's value $11.30, which makes my ROI 28.25%. So pretty bad, and on my scale that's a 2.8. For fun factor, I'm only giving it a one. There's only gold in one classification, and it, I'm probably being generous by giving it a one. For Pater description, it's getting a two. There's really no information there. Now for quantity and packaging, this is pretty much where the only redeeming quality of this bag, they're getting an eight. And that's because it was packaged and it was some dirt. No specific amount as stated in the description, but I got some dirt and it came in a package. Now for customer service and shipping, they're only getting a five. They're getting a 10 for shipping because it shipped out really quickly, but customer service is getting a zero. There is actually no way to contact them on their website. Even if you log in, make a purchase, there is no contact information anywhere on their site. So there's no way to ask them a question if you have a problem or anything else. And they do sell on eBay, and I emailed them multiple times on eBay about a question which I will be bringing up later in this video, and they never replied. So for customer service and shipping, they're getting a five. So total score right here for Loaded Paydirt's Nugget Edition with no guaranteed gold is a 3.8. Pretty bad, and definitely not worth buying again. Now for their one gram guaranteed Nugget Edition bag, I paid $90, shipping was free, total cost right here, 90 bucks. Gold I recovered, 
again, right here, 0 0.985 grams. So not even the one gram that was guaranteed. Gold spot on the day this was received was again $57.96, making this gold's value worth $57.09, which makes my ROI 63.43%, or on my scale, a 6.3. Now, for fun factor, I'm dropping it down to a 4. It wasn't fun. Gold was only in two classifications, and I didn't even recover the full gram. It was pretty close, so I'm not really digging them too bad on that. A little fluctuation on a scale maybe could be the 0 0.005, but it's just, uh Now, for painter description, again, they're getting a 2. Quantity and packaging, again, 8. The only redeeming quality of even the one gram bag is that they do ship you some dirt, and it's in a bag. Now, for customer service and shipping, again, getting a 5, 10 for shipping, and 0 for customer service. So, total score for Loaded Pay Dirt's Nugget Edition bag with 1 gram of gold is a 5.1. So, still not even a good score there. Now, I will say I do need to update some information about this review. When I purchased this Pay Dirt, gold was at $57.96. Now they have since raised their prices. I believe the Nugget Edition bag with no guaranteed gold is now around $50. But the big kicker is the one gram bag is now $350. That's right, $350 for that. I just recalculated my math based on new current spot. And if I paid $50 for that, my ROI would have been 23%. But if I would have paid $350 for this, I would have only gotten a 17% ROI. This is just horrible. How anyone could sell a one gram of pay dirt for $350 is beyond me. And the only reason I could possibly think that any seller would do that is because when you realized you were only going to get a 20% ROI out of one of these bags, why wouldn't you go for one of these bags and get a 60% ROI? And what's that do? That means a seller is losing 80% profit every time someone switches from this bag to this bag. So if you make the one gram bag the worst bag, no one's going to buy it and they're going to switch this one. Either way, horrible. Absolutely horrible. $350 for a one gram bag of pay dirt. Ugh, just horrible. All right, all that's left is a giveaway of 20 flat. All that's left is the flash of the score and give away a 24 karat gold plated dime. So let's just flash up the scores right here. Now for today's 24 karat gold plated dime winner and just the gold plated dime, this one right here, that's going to go to Brian Connolly. So Brian Connolly, make sure you email me so I can send this off to you and to everyone else. Thanks for watching, happy panning, and make sure you hit the subscribe button below if you're not already a subscriber.